Despite news the Saudi Arabian government agreed to a slight increase in production, oil briefly hit an all-time high today at $140 a barrel before coming back down to about $134. So will the Saudi relief help, or are the problems really right here at home? Joining us now, Florida Congressman Connie Mack and California Congressman Adam Schiff. Congressman Mack, let me ask you about what Dick Morris is saying, that it's, the reason it's 150 as opposed to 70 or 80 is it because of commodities. You've got to stop speculators from being able to speculate on oil. And once you stop that, you can bring it down to more natural levels. It's not about supply and demand in terms of how high it is. Well, certainly it is about supply and demand, and I believe what we need to do is take a serious look at what we can do here in the United States, whether it's build new refineries, look at nuclear power, and drilling either off the coast of Florida or in Alaska. None of these things are being addressed by this Congress. The Democrats need to be bold, need to bring, bring bold ideas to the front, and they're just not doing that. Well, you blame the Democrats. John McCain is against drilling in a number of places, including Anwar. He's gone back and forth on a couple of locations, but he wouldn't drill in Anwar either. Well, look, I think the, uh, the delegation here in the Congress supports drilling in Alaska. Uh, the Alaskan legislature supports it, and the people of Alaska support it. Uh, and they, sh they had their say. In s the state of Florida, I would vote today to lift the moratorium. Uh, but as long as the state of Florida has a say, like Alaska has, we need to go and get more domestic oil uh, out of the ground. Well, you've got Republican running, uh, you know, you've got Republicans in Florida, you've got McCain, they don't want to uh, uh, drill there. Adam Schiff, you've got the Joint Economic Committee, says it would take 10 years for Anwar to get online, reduce gas prices maybe by a penny a gallon by 2018, and by 2025, less than 1% of the world production is all it would be. So it's pretty negligible uh, what that would really accomplish. Well, I think that's right. I mean, we could, uh, as you say, develop all of Anwar, and it would take us 10 years, and it wouldn't have much effect on price. Uh, the problem is we can't drill our way out of this. Uh, we, even if we developed all of Alaska off all of our coastline, if we drilled in Yellowstone, we would still only have about 1 to 2 percent of the oil, of the world supply of oil, but our demand is about 25 percent. There's no way we can drill our way out of this problem. We have to reduce demand, which is why I think we need an Apollo project-like effort to wean ourselves off of fossil well, fuels, uh, to Schiff. develop uh, new technologies, and, and try to deal with the demand side of the problem. Well, I'm, I'm driving a Chevy uh, Tahoe hybrid. I'm all in favor of new technology, but uh, we have more, oh, you read Investors Business Daily, we have more oil than all these Middle Eastern countries uh, combined if only we tap the resources, if you increase supply uh, and the demand stays stable, you lower the price. I want to ask you a question, though. Fifteen percent of the price of a gallon of gasoline, Wall Street Journal reports, goes to taxes. Only four percent goes to these oil companies. And you say on your, your, your website you want to look at the record oil pr prices and profits of these oil companies. Why don't you look after yourself and the government that taxes us? You don't explore, you don't extract crude, you don't refine it, and you don't deliver a product. Why do you get more money than the, these evil oil companies, and why do you go after them? Well, the reason that I would go after the, the tax benefits we're giving the oil industry, Sean, is that they don't need those tax benefits. They were enacted a few years ago, and now the industry is at record profits. I don't think they need uh, corporate welfare. Rather, yeah. I would provide those same tax breaks, the same amount, so we're not talking about increasing the tax load. We're talking about shifting those tax benefits to s the solar industry, to geothermal, to wind energy. Though? Shift it to those industries that we want to incentivize, Sean, because, as, as again, as if I we're going to wean ourselves off of fossil fuel, we have to develop alternatives. As much as you say that the oil companies that explore, extract, refine, and deliver a product and get less money than the government does, I would argue government doesn't need the money either. So maybe you can give back the money. But I want to ask one question to Connie well, Mack. But, but Sean, what yeah. I'm saying is, uh, I'm saying that don't have the government keep the money. Take those tax benefits that we're giving the oil about, industry no, no, that doesn't need them. Give back our tax money on the give gallon those, of gasoline. Give those, same, give those same tax benefits that we're giving the oil industry to solar, to wind, to the Last other question, industries. Will you support, give them cutting, will you support eliminating the federal gas tax? Uh, no, because we no, need to con continue not. to build our roads not. and bridges. <laughs> I mean, Sean, you might remember right, uh, we had a tragic bridge collapse, and we talked about all of the infrastructure needs that we have in the country. Uh, we could re we could yeah, remove all the, the federal taxes. Not, not we could remove all take. of the, the federal gets taxes. The all right, Sean, we so we could Sean, remove Sean. all of the federal taxes Guys, I'm out of on, time. Uh, on gasoline and still not affect price, uh, except we Mack, would expand I, I, oil industry profits. I promise we'll have you back. We did shortchange it tonight. Nothing Adam said does anything to reduce...
All right, gas we'll, prices. I, we'll, I promise we'll have you back. When we come back, we'll continue to remember the uh, life and legacy of Tim Russert, one of his appearances on this program next.